Hello YouTube and welcome back to another video on this channel. In today's video, we are playing this game, Stands Awakening, and I'm making another how-to video for you guys, for those of you who need help in this game. So, um, today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to trade, and um, it's, it's confusing because there's no literal button that you can press to trade, and like when you first start joining the game, it's, it's like, it's confusing how to trade, okay? So I'm going to be showing you guys how to trade, and let's get into the video. Alrighty, so trading is actually really easy, you just need to figure it out, after that you're pretty much set. So I have my alt right here, and I'm just going to go ahead and just show you guys right off the bat. So the first thing you need to do is go into chat. It's one of those chat commands that you have to do, so we're going to go ahead and do that. So what you have to do is put exclamation mark trade, and then a part of their username, so that the game recognizes them. Once I do this, I'll press enter, and then on my screen, it says what stands I've traded to them, and they have to actually accept. So I'm going to go ahead and go on my alt account and accept the trade. Accepted. Okay, the trade is accepted, and as you guys can see, boom, I just selected this. All you have to do is press accept. I, I tried doing it the first time, but I lagged, so I thought I had to do it a second time, but you just only have to do it one time. So that's actually how you trade things. So trading is pretty easy, but now I'm going to show you guys how to give items, and it's, it's basically kind of like the same thing. So all you have to do is equip the item that you want to give. It has to be from your inventory, like everything you have in your inventory. So now I have to equip it, I have to be holding it out, and then I have to go in the chat. And I have to say give item, and then I have to put their name. And boom, it the, the item just disappeared from my inventory, and now it's on my alt account. Uh, this was a short video for you guys. Uh, hopefully it helped you guys out somewhat. I mean, if it helped you guys out, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. It really helps a ton. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Okay, so for those of you who are staying after the video ended, uh, thank you. So what I have to say is that this video might be one of the last videos where I'm using this Roblox account right here, FrostX underscore YouTube. I have a lot of stuff on it, and this is really sad because, like, there's this hacker who recently got into my account and he's saying, like, he's threatening me. He's threatening me and blackmailing me, uh, and he's telling me if I don't do some stuff, then he's gonna get my Roblox account terminated. Um, so, right now, I'm on the account right now, but apparently he says that he has, like, he can terminate my Roblox account, something about him having my account stubbed. I have no idea what these things mean, but hopefully, I mean, hopefully he's just bluffing. Hopefully, I, I, I still able to use this account. This account is really old, ever since like 2016. It's a really OG account. I have so much stuff on it, so I'm really hoping that this account is safe. Hope you guys wish me luck, and yeah, that's all I had to say. So wish me luck. You guys probably think that I could just like email Roblox about this, but. Surprisingly, actually not surprisingly, uh, Roblox does not reply to their emails, like, literally, at all. Like, after our account has been banned, after a month, it's permanently banned. And my brother has gotten his account banned multiple times, but Roblox never replies to fix that for him, so I'm not sure what's gonna happen, but just, just wish me luck, guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!